Hey everybody, Jamie here from Full Bench Gaming. Got another episode today of the OG EV tournament that's happening right now. Went ahead and did round two just a little bit ago um, versus a Gramble deck. Uh, GG's to my opponent, won't ruin the surprise for you here, um, and we'll just go ahead and jump right into it. Have fun, guys. Hey guys, what's up? Jamie here from Full Bench Gaming. I'm gonna go ahead and jump into round two of the OG EV tournament. We're gonna go ahead and be facing our boy Ryder1313. I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure that was him who sent me a request, so we'll just go ahead and challenge him and hope for the best. Uh, it'll be the Zoro Lycanroc also. Um, same as last time, all the cards are the same, um, as we still can't change the list uh, for the rest of the uh, rest of the tournament. So we'll be facing Granbull today. Uh, I hear she's got a couple of spicy cards kind of mixed in here and there, so not necessarily your typical Granbull list, but that's okay. We'll see what we can do. I, mean, I am a little bit scared about this matchup. I'm not sure what um, what to expect, really. So let's jump in. Let's see what we got. Haven't really had a whole lot of practice with this matchup. So basically, you're just going to go off the fact that I want to get a muck out as quickly as possible. And then target down Orangaroos and... Um, and mag cargos. So he'll be going first. Which is a bit unfortunate, but that's okay. Let's see how she goes. Okay, so I'm gonna have to start a ditto, which is a bit off putting, but that's okay. Okay, so I will get a mulligan. Ah, uh, custom catchers, okay and order pads, roger that. Let's hope for some tails. I think I saw Crushing Hammer in there also. So let's hope for some tails. Yes, I would, thank you. Okay, there's our first tails, and pass, roger that. Hmm. <clears throat> I think I just sent the other hand away, guys. Could judge, but eh. Yeah. Rip. Just gonna go ahead and Cynthia. Yep. Not a good start, but that's okay. Hmm. Guess I could place the sneasel. One, two, possibly next turn. I think I just put them down for the lulls. And then I feel like I want to get a Zeru out. Ooh. Yeah, this is a bit tough, guys. Go one, two, and then Zerua. Far out. Uh, I think I have to save that. I think I have to save it. So if he knocks out the ditto, that's that's bad news. So I think I have to do this so that I can retreat and put the Sneasel out. And then end my turn. I do not want that ditto being knocked out. Yeah, okay. See, that's what we were worried about. But at least we got an extra turn to set up. We'll go ahead and Elm here. Uh, we'll go one, two, three. Uh, is that what we want? Got all four of those. We got a Macargo. We're not gonna use it. We got the Muck. That's good. Two of those. Two of those. What are we looking? Three, two. Not bad. Counter gains. Uh, got the Acerola. Do we have? We got the Pal Pad and the Max Potion. I think we're looking okay. 
What we do? Uh, two, four. Yeah, I can't really. Maybe a Guzma. Uh, judge. Yeah, we're missing a judge and an elm. Um, what about my devoured? Got one, two devoured. Yeah, that looks fine to me. Okay, one, two, three. And we're gonna go ahead and Ultra Ball the Choice Band and the Kikui. And we're gonna bring ourselves up the old Macaroonie. And evolve. And we'll end our turn. All right. So we'll see. Okay, that's good for us. I think we want a Cynthia here. We don't want to judge because he's just got the one. We don't want to help him out. Okay. Um. Maybe we leave that slot open for now. Let's just do this real quick. Trade the choice band. Counter gain, yeah, that's not gonna help. All right, let's just drop this. And then we have Guzma next turn. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully we can get ourselves a DCE. It would be nice. Gonna nest ball out probably another grant or snubble. Yep. All right. Okay, so we're gonna trade the choice band. Trade the elm. Okay, so we didn't get. We can get that, but maybe we can judge. No, I don't want to judge. I just don't. So I'll maybe I'll kakui. Yeah, I think I'll kakui here. Yeah, didn't get shite. Okay. Yep, see if we can Guzma play next turn. What's he got here? Any supporter? Man, I really wish we could capitalize on his bad start right here. We had a great start as far as getting the muck out, but unfortunately we haven't been able to find a DCE gonna order pad probably for an ultra ball Ooh, bummer okay let's get some trades in trade the cargo trade the volpix trade trade out the Zaruba oh man we got our mop mallow hmm I think we saved the mallow no we should probably play the mallow right now yeah, we'll get the mallow in right now. And we'll do a DCE and maybe a Lycanroc. Because we have the Guzmas, maybe the Switch instead. Could just do two DCEs, but that seems a bit overkill.
Yeah, I think maybe we do this. Alright, we'll do that. And then end our turn. Alright, there's nothing else. Could drop that, but it just seems like a waste. Because if he's gonna gramble, he's gonna gramble and it'll knock me out anyway. So might as well just have him knock out the sneeze. Yeah, okay. Draw three cards. Make a mess, all right. Got the knockout, that's good for him. Now here, do I focus Slugmas or do I focus Snubbles? I feel like I might focus the Oranguru even. I think I focus Slugmas here. for the slugma um, and then maybe we just do a rescue stretcher what else is good there yeah I guess I can rescue stretcher yeah we'll do this one Maybe the Sneasel? I don't think the Sneasel. It's either the Volpix or the Zerua. I think maybe the Zerua. I don't think I remember the Ninetales being in my deck, so we'll do the Zerua. We're gonna trade here. Are we gonna trade? Yeah, we're gonna trade for the Weavile. Alright, so we're just gonna ride his beating now. So he'll be able to hit this turn. And Twenty one hundred devoured on Kukui. Do I have no, I don't have Kukui's. Hmm. I can max potion this, I'm pretty sure. Can max potion. Hmm. Counter gain will hurt a bit. 60. Get the knockout. Okay, so I throw the devoured, I reckon. I think we need to do some trading. If I can get an Ace Aurora, I think. That would be ideal. Or I can just... Hmm. I can rock up for the Macargo or the Ditto. Hmm. You could just trade a couple more times.
is the Acerola. Can Acerola bring up the Zoroark? Or I can try and judge and make it so that he can't do it. It's worth a shot, right? I think it is. Maybe bring up the Oranguru right now. Or the other Macargo. Yeah, let's bring up the Macargo. Yeah, let's do it. Timer and see if we can get. Yeah, fair enough. All right, it's B. <laughs> There's the tails. Oh my goodness, he has not hit a order pad this entire time. So I don't run order pads. I hate timer balls. I hate order pads. I have to run a timer ball. Just because I basically have to, but I just hate him. Ooh, hit him with the crushing, he said. Ooh, he's gonna hit him with the crushing. I like it. Can he do it? So we're going to start trading. Mm. One, two, three, it's 150. I can bloodthirsty for knockout. Rogue, sorry. <clears throat> oh, he wants that order pad so bad. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> that's sad. I'll hit him with the sad face because that's pretty sad. So I'd like a Guzma here, I think. Hmm. Okay, yeah, he's just gonna throw it. That's fine. Okay, so we took game one. That was good. Oh, getting a challenge from him, that's right. Accept that. Um, probably just got lucky with a bad start on on his part because we had an awful start. <clears throat> so um, we'll let him go first. Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> okay, it's a better start, I reckon. I 
think I have to save Kukui's this time. Because I think that they're pretty important for hitting numbers. Let's see what he can start out with this time. Can he hit an order pad? Cannot. Can he draw three cards? Or just one? Yep, he can. It's another nest ball. He is all in on the monkeys. Good start for him. cheeky okay okay so I don't have to ultra ball for so that's good I can keep everything I think we will drop the Lele here yes I would like to I think we will get a lecture let me just do a quick search we have the ears so we have another Kakui we got the mallow one judge two judges altogether three Guzmas, that is correct. One, two, three, four. Three, four. Got the muck. Do we have the ditto? We do, thank God. Switch. Four, three, counter gains. Max potion. Yeah, I reckon we'll do fine with this. Okay, okay so we're going to go ahead and make sure. Lecture. We'll grab ourselves one, two, and three. Uh, three. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, we'll do that. Boom, boom, boom. Probably should have switched out a Zorua for a Lycan Rock on that one. Now that I think about it, because I forgot I had one in the active already. And that'll be our turn. Um, so yeah, probably could have just brought out a, a rock rough on that one. Let's see what he can do. He's got a lot of yumminess on the Rangaroo front for him. So if he can just ditch cards and go, that's really good for him. attach that but I'm sure that he had to because of the instruct oh that's bad news for him okay we'll attach here and then I feel like we're gonna ditch these two we're gonna grab ourselves big boy muck so we'll have turn two muck again Nice, hit the muck. And I reckon I'll just cook. Uh, let me trade first. Uh, no, I'm gonna Kakui here first. Okay, trade for the Guzma. Yay, I got a DC and a Rock Ruff, that's great. Right to speed him. Okay, so we're off to an okay start. Hopefully this timer ball hits. If this timer ball hits, that'd be amazing. Okay, so there's the shrine. I knew there was a shrine somewhere in this deck. That's why I was hesitant to play any of my devoured fields. He does have, yeah, resistance from me. Can he drop the last one? Oh, he's in giant fangs. Wow, that's tricky. So he definitely has a knockout on me next turn. No matter what. So I think I ace a roll of this one. 
Let's throw the timer ball in. Oh, two heads, wow. Um, if I have two heads, maybe I just go for the Oranguru. Yeah, I think I do that. And then I play the Mallow. Oh no! That's okay, I can Mallow for a Rescue Stretcher. Okay, so my other Lycanroc is priced, but that's fine. I'll double this here. Yeah. Okay. Mallow for a DCE and a switch, or uh, a DCE and a Lycanroc, or a Rescue Stretcher. DCE, Rescue Stretcher, DCE, Max Potion. DC Max Potion. Maybe a DC Max Potion is the best way to go. Because so I can Max Potion the damage away, place the other DCE, but I guess this way I save a DCE. No, I think I, I, think I Max Potion here. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm gonna trade the switch for it, I think. Ah. Yeah, I'm gonna trade the switch for it because I really feel like I have to judge him and then the ace roll is just too good. So I'm gonna max potion. DC. Uh, no, I don't want to trade anymore, but I do want to write his beating. Yeah, so I'll do 100. Maybe I should have gone for... Nah, I just don't. I was thinking maybe a Devoured Field, but it just doesn't feel good. Okay, so he can all out. Hmm. Okay, so here I judge. I reckon probably judge. Unless he. Because if he just gets one card, I could Ace Arola here. Ace Arola, throw out one of my boys, and knock that out, and just leave him with a one -er. I think I do that. Yeah, I do that. Maybe I just trade the Kikui. I need cards. I know I said that I should save that, but... I think this is better to do right now. Okay, fair enough. So we're gonna ride us. Get a knockout. I think we're sitting okay right now. So if he can't pull like a support card or a ball, if he pulls an ultra ball, no, a great ball right here and pulls a great ball and a grand ball would be epic for him right now. Cool. Okay. Well, there you go, guys. We took it 2-0. Um, yeah. I think the muck is just really good and he just did not draw here. Um, his order pads were tails all day. So, um, GG to my opponent. Um, bad luck on, on the draws, I reckon. Um, you might have wished that it would have gone a couple of different ways, but uh, good game. Uh, the muck is just 
it's it's brutal here. <laughs> the muck is real brutal. Uh, so we'll go ahead and um, proceed to the next uh, to the next round of the OG EV tournament. Um, looks like a lot of Bocephalons, a lot of um, uh, Buzz Shrines, um, some Desi Tails, and I think I saw a couple of Gardevoir decks also. Um, and then I did see two other, I believe, Zoro Rock decks. So, um, yeah, we may find a mirror eventually in here. I hope not. I hope not. I haven't really practiced a whole lot of the mirror, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, so, again, good game to my opponent. Uh, and I'll, I'll see you guys next time. See ya. So there you have it, guys. That was our match today uh, versus the Grand Bull. I uh, went ahead and took the W two O, which is good. Um, and yeah, I reckon my opponent's probably too happy about the draws that he had and about the coin flips, but that's the risk you take when you play order pads and crushing hammers and stuff like that. So uh, we went ahead and pulled out the win. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, No Josh Coins, over at www.collectibles.nojosh.com.au. Go ahead and give them some love, guys first purchase if you're a new customer and you sign up for their newsletter it will go ahead and give you a percentage off of your first purchase so go ahead and go there for all your tcg needs whether that be cards or accessories and give them some love let them know that your boys over at full bench gaming sent you cool you guys have a nice one see ya